Hello friends, so welcome to Crypto The One Stop Solution and in this video we are going to take a new, new token that is Chain GPT. We are going to analyze this token and we are going to set up a bot and we are going to discuss the parameters of the robot of Chain GPT using Bitscap application and KuCoin exchange. So let us get started. Search uh, Chain GPT on CoinMarketCap first. So Chain uh, GPT. Search this token and Currently, the market cap of this token is $6.3 million and as compared to the market cap, the rank of this token is 883 and the trading volume is $1.1 million and the trading volume rank is 594. Supply is only 11.23% as of now and total supply is 1 billion CGPT tokens. Now the current market cap is $6.4 million and the price is $0.05. This is available on multiple markets such as KuCoin, Uniswap, Bybit, Gate.io and BitGet etc. You can check out the contracts of this token. So this is based on Ethereum blockchain. You can check the holders. So Uniswap is holding 44.56%, this address is holding 11% and so on. So significant amount of holding is at Uniswap. So let us check out the address of Uniswap and go to analytics so here you can see that this address is accumulating the tokens with respect to time the graph is rising so if this address is accumulating tokens that means this address is purchasing the tokens and keeping the tokens for himself that means the price should appreciate in the long run and other holders are insignificant so if this holder is trying to accumulate the coin then a significant amount of pump can happen in this coin so let us check out the market cap you can see that the coin is trading at about 5 cents which is at the support so that's a good thing once the pump occurs in the market at any point of time then you can sell the coin and get exit from the trade so let us find out the support so good support is at 0.05 and let us keep the target price at 0 0.07 0 0.07 is the good price or you can keep at 0 0.069 so support is at 0 0.05 and the target price is 0 0.069 go to bitscap start a new bot click on create bot and search the ticker that is cgpt cgpt G P T. Okay, so this is available on the USDT pair investment. Let us say hundred dollars. Go to manual adjustment. The low price is zero point zero five dollars, and the upper price is zero point zero six nine dollars. Levels is let us say hundred number of levels, and turn off the trailing up option and click on backtest. So monthly return is thirteen point seven seven percent. That's a good return. If the trading fee is 0.1 percentage in that particular case the monthly return will become 18.76 and if you are using the kch token to deduct the trading fees in that particular case let us see how much return it will generate on the monthly basis so this is a giving a return of 20.22 percentage on a monthly basis then click on continue and start the bot you can final check the parameters like exchange is kucoin pair is cgpt investment amount is hundred dollars profit currency is usdt the high price is 0.069 and the low price is 0.05 and based on the high price value low price value the grid levels the step size is automatically defined that is equal to 0.32 percentage so when all the parameters are defined you can start the bot on bitscap application now let us see how we can set up a bot on KuCoin exchange. Go to trade, go to trading bot. You can search the spot grid, search uh, CGPT. Click on this token. Uh, this graph is automatically populated and the price of this token is 0 0.056. The low price can be at 0 0.05 and the upper price can be at 0 0.069. Minimum balance required is 10 and orders is 2 to 43. Let us keep 40. Minimum let us say 10. You can invest any amount of money about $10. You can skip the entry price because we are starting the bot at the entry price that is optional. You can skip the stop loss and take profit price you can keep at 0 0.0691. And then click on create. So that's how you can create a bot of CGPT token on uh, Bitscap application and KuCoin exchange. So that's it for this video and I'll see you in the next one.